Hi, this is Geneva Maika Almodaro, your student nurse from UCCM. And for today's video, I'm going to show you how to perform chest physiotherapy. First is I need to make the patient comfortable with her position. Are you comfortable? And then explain the procedure. So ma'am, our procedure chest physiotherapy is a group of treatments that are designed to improve uh, respiratory efficiency, promote expansion of the lungs, strengthen your respiratory muscles, and eliminate secretions from respiratory system. Use a stethoscope to determine areas of needed drainage. So ma'am, um, let me assist you in a sitting position. Upper lobes are generally drained by upright positions, while lower and middle lobes are drained by head down positions. Encourage patients to cough right after the allotted time in each position. One, two, three, cough! <coughs> For precaution, instruct the patient to use diaphragmatic breathing. Position patient in prescribed postural drainage position. The spine should be straight to promote ribcage expansion. For cost or clock with cupped hands over the chest wall for 1 to 2 minutes. From the lower ribs to top of chest in front. From the lower ribs to the shoulders in the back. Avoid clapping over the spine, liver, kidneys, spleen, breast, scapula, clavicle, or sternum. Instruct the patient to inhale slowly and deeply. Vibrate the chest wall as the patient exhales slowly through pursed lips. Place one hand on top of the other over the affected area or place one hand on each side of the cage. Tense muscles of hands and arms while applying moderate pressure and vibrate hands and arms. Relieve pressure on thorax as the patient inhales. Encourage patient to cough using her abdominal muscles for 3 to 4 vibrations. <coughs> Allow patient to rest for several minutes and then use the stethoscope to find out any changes in breathing sounds. And the breathing, breathe out. And we're done.